BP Charge Master, as it's now called, is a 10-year-old company. We were bought by BP last year. Uh, we're the UK's leading provider of charging infrastructure for electric vehicles, so that's both hardware. So we make the unit lights behind me here, the rapid charger. We also make home charging units, commercial charging units. And we also operate the UK's largest public charging network called Polar. So that's our network name. Drivers will know uh, using a Polar charging point, for example. Uh, so we're now part of BP, and one of the big things we're doing with BP over the coming months will be to deploy ultra-fast 150 kilowatt chargers on BP forecourts. So those will give you a range for the vehicles that can charge charge at those speeds at up to about 100 miles in just 10 minutes. So we're talking about a really quick charge for the time it takes to pop in, have a coffee and come out back to the car again. Uh, charge Master was acquired by BP uh, last summer, so in July last year, and we've rebranded to BP Charge Master just January, uh, January just passed. Um, what it really does is obviously gives BP a huge amount of strength in this field now. So they've acquired the market leader, um, obviously operating 6,500 charging points across the UK, but also with a huge customer base. So we work with around 50,000 drivers in the UK, uh, both in terms of our public charging customers, but also those who have got a home charging unit. Uh, work with 11 of the car brands in the UK to supply units directly to their customers as well. Um, so we really kind of have strength and scale now uh, of BP behind us to drive us forward faster. We've always believed that the infrastructure market needs to stay slightly ahead of the car market. It's no good lagging behind where the cars are. Um, so that's true today. So if you look at the charging networks out there, um, there's, there's, no, there's no network that's used in 100% you know, utilisation. There's lots of headroom in the networks that exist already. Um, we've been investing uh, millions of pounds into charging infrastructure in the UK for several years now. To create, and we created the first privately funded network called Polar in the UK many years ago. Uh, what the BP acquisition has allowed us to do is actually get access, obviously, to the BP site. So we've got access potentially to 1,200 BP forecourts across the UK, but also again to strengthen the scale of BP, the investment that's going to be required in growing our network. So it's absolutely going to roll out our network faster into new areas such as the ultra fast chargers, 150 kilowatt deploying this year, um, and just giving us the added ability to scale quicker. So the next couple of years, BP Charge Master will uh, start to be focused more on the ultra-fast charging side. So we're, as I say, deploying 150 kilowatt chargers from this year. You'll see them ramp up in the years to come. It's a rollout. It's not a trial. We are rolling out this technology. Uh, and then obviously moving into other areas. So smart charging for home. We'll be de developing those solutions into the customers' homes. Uh, and you'll also probably see some, you know, some sort of bundling propositions as we start to see the overlap between home and public charging. Another key area is obviously in the B2B space, which a lot of people seem to ignore. Huge users of public charging will be fleets and B2B customers. Um, for them, the pay-as-you-go kind of ad hoc receipts that you get from some companies aren't really acceptable. So what we have in the market today is a, subscri it's a subscription proposition that allows single monthly invoicing for a fleet. And obviously with BP having existing fuel cards, bringing those two things together for, for fleet drivers is going to be really, really powerful.